Well, they're doing the World Cup version of Moth. First round. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life, yeah. On the bright side. Yeah, this music here became my only lifeline. Think I'm going crazy, I'm not in my right mind. No. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life, yeah. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life, yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are gonna work on that jugs machine. So it's been about two weeks since we've had the machine. We've been using it pretty often, not quite daily, but pretty often. The boys will get out here and we'll run maybe a hundred balls through it, you know, catching passes in different positions and they'll kind of run some routes. Remember there was a couple parts on there that uh, were broken. Uh, the guy that I bought it from, I messaged him just saying, hey, look, this is the deal. That one side that I think I showed you in the previous video where they had machined part of it, where it's broken, that slide. They thought they had fixed the slide to where the wheel would go um, all the way that it needed to go. But unfortunately, they just had it going level and it needed to actually be able to tilt down. So anyways, he said, look, my fault. Totally apologize. Thought we had it corrected. Go ahead and order whatever part you need to get and I'll take care of it. So perfect. Got the part ordered from Jugs. It has now come in, so we're gonna put the new part on, and actually went ahead and got a couple other little parts. I'll show you that. So let's figure out how to get this thing uh, fixed. Gavin and I are gonna work on it, figure it out as we go, and hopefully if you have a broken jugs machine or need something fixed, or just wanna know how to fix one, we're gonna figure it out today. So stay tuned, here we go. This was an after, he had just kind of made a little aftermarket thing to tighten, and it honestly did not work well. It would not hold these legs in properly, so when you tried to move it around, yeah, it just, it was so loose. So I went ahead and bought one of these, and it works great. It, it gets it good and tight. That other part did not. You know, here's that part. So I've got to take this whole piece off, and I'm not exactly sure. I'm imagining I've got to take those bolts out, and I'll have to take this wheel off.
put the motor back in, gonna fasten it down, just gonna clean it up a little bit. You wanna line it back up with your four holes, make sure your jugs. Information and stuff is on the outside so it's lined up properly. Put our Allen wrench bolts back through. have this secured we're going to go ahead and wire wire things back in it's actually labeled underneath where you have a positive and your negative and then you just have a ground so all right so that little square it's like a little square drive shaft so obviously you want to make sure that it lines up and you can spin and if you can kind of see you can kind of spin around to make sure it gets lined up good and then obviously your bolts will go back through the holes just a tad bit of an issue getting the the shaft collar I guess is what you'd call it to slide onto this cap as my dad used to say you just gotta hold your mouth just right to get it to go on <laughs> kind of a tight fit now to put the tire back on so there's a red line on the hub and then there's a marking on the tire that says line it up so make sure those are lined up once that lines up the nuts as well so then we'll tighten it up now we plug it up and test it out going nice tight spirals Gavin, you can defend him. No, you can't. Go. Three, two, one. Oh, it's a bump fit. How? Oh, that was literally... The fact they can only throw. Call it if you hey. It's a fumble. Fumble! Oh, I got it. Call it. Call it. You're going the wrong way, buddy. All right. Catch. That's a catch. Fumble! 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 Oh, he... Come on! Oh my gosh! Oh, oh my gosh! Tackle! Oh, Kevin! Oh, Alright, so the boys are wanting to play a game of Moss, so we have it tilted pretty high up. Low speed, obviously, because we're not going to send it 80 yards. All right, here we go. Ready? Oh, right, they're doing the World Cup version of Moss. First round. Oh, Gavin in the back. Let's go. Oh, Gavin comes away with it. Oh, Gavin. All right, the jugs machine is working like it should, so it was a success. Of course, the boys are having fun. Still back there playing a little moss. Guys, thanks for tuning in, and we'll catch you in that next episode. Bye-bye. Welcome to my life. Welcome to my life, yeah. Welcome to my life. Welcome to my life.